Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is India and today we have another Kelly Moore unboxing for you. Um, recently Kelly Moore had her Mother's Day sale, which means that things were up to a hundred dollars off. Do you know how huge that is? Like that makes you decide to get some things that you wouldn't have bought otherwise. So that's what I did. Okay. Um, so I know I've recently put out a video of my entire Kelly Moore collection. Well, let's add one to the bunch today and let's get started. This one I'm pumped for. Pumped for, pumped for, pumped for, pumped for, pumped for, pumped for, pumped for. Oh, I was like, what was that? You know, normally I would do this in my bedroom where I got some more space. I didn't feel like moving. Ugh, this thing, I can already tell it's giant. Which is what people said. People said it was big in their reviews. You know, I've gotta be one of those review people like in on the website and I'm just not. I'm not, cause whatever. Oh, giant. But guys, I got this bag. It was on sale, which is how I like to do it. On sale, on sale. I finally got the tourist. I'm so excited. I'm so excited, cause, oh, look at this, pockets. You can just, look at this, you can already tell the back. I, okay, let me calm down. <sighs> India, India, get it together get it together just breathe 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 your bangs are everywhere your faux bangs your you put bobby pins in your hair bangs okay so you can already tell the back is made to try and give you a little bit of ventilation back here which is fantastic because you know the point of having a tourist backpack is to walk around with it for long periods of time so i do love that about it i love that so that's already one aspect that i enjoy Let's go, we have two, two side pockets over here. They're not that expandable. They're not that expandable. So getting a water bottle in here would actually be a little bit of a challenge. Getting like a pretty significant water bottle in here, you know, might actually be a challenge. Like, I've got a small one that I, had in my owl crate unboxing for May. You know, it's it's a small water bottle. Ugh. And so I've got plenty much width wise, but you know, getting it in there, stretching it out would be a problem. So, but you've got one on either side though. So you could probably put in like two two legs of your tripod maybe and then do it like that but there's no straps on the side so maybe not the best for that let's see going from the front you've got pockets on the front kelly moore always remembers to put in pockets always boom nice nice deep front pocket here lovely lovely Mm, I'm missing a, that's actually in like a pretty wide pocket because it's like it's here but it's pretty wide width wise and it's all of this and then you've got your pocket here which I'm pretty sure is about to open up oh no it opens flat fantastic and so you've got more storage you've got a zippered compartment here great for cords and things like that you've got I don't know what this is for. Oh, okay, so this does open up into the like camera compartment. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Guys, we're learning this together. Okay, we're learning this together. Chill. So this does open up to your inside compartment as per usual Kelly Moore. You've got plenty of dividers and plenty of space to make your own um, dividers where you need them. They're all Velcro, so just move them in or out, all around and stuff like that. Zipper, zipper that up, zipper that up. Ugh. It's beautiful, y'all. It's leather. 
That's one reason why it's so damn expensive. It's because it's leather. And you've got the top. The top. Also, more stuff. More Velcro. More ways to organize all your equipment. Whatever you need. And this, that goes all the way down, is your laptop sleeve. So you can just slide your laptop in it. I don't remember what size sleeve this is. I'm thinking 13 inch. I don't feel like you could fit a 15 inch in here. The laptop is is meant to sit in front of your gear. 13 inch laptop, yeah. So this does fit a 13 inch laptop in there and it's removable from here. So on the inside, both of these um, padded compartments in here are removable. So you can just use this as a backpack if you don't have, want to put your camera stuff in it. But like, see this? Look at that. You can take the whole thing out and you've got your top part empty for people who either don't have that much gear or want to put something else on top. And so like this is like your own bucket. So you can also just remove the top and not have the curved part filled if you want to stuff a jacket or something like that in there. See? Ways to fully customize it for your needs for whatever is necessary. Which makes it so amazing. You have just so many little dividers that just help this bad boy out. There we go. We shape that. That's bothering me. Perfect. Put that down. And so you also have these interior pockets, these clear ones, and a little zipper pocket. Great for passport. Passport would fit in there with ease. Um, some cards, IDs, and stuff. I'm surprised she doesn't have a like a wallet section in here, but it's so big you could easily put put your wallet in here. And then, like I said, you could take out this whole bottom bucket if you wanted to. And then you could even put things like. You could even do it so that way books and other things are on the bottom and your camera gear is on the top. Whatever you want to do and however your gear is fitting your needs. So it's all just so fully customizable. And it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. Oh, leather. You, I just, I can. It's gorgeous. I have a problem. I've already said that a few times, but it's okay. Let's see how. Got top handles. Of course, it's a backpack, two zippers, because, I don't know, I'm a zip at the top type of person. If you're, like, a peak design person, you can always get those, um, those straps, in you know, those, um, that, like, capture clip and put it on the straps. That's not bad. Some people were saying it's really big. And so, see, on my back, I'm about 5'8", and a lot of weight. <laughs> And so that's not so bad on my back, actually. It fits like, like a normal uh, North Face on my back, like a North Face backpack, not like a camping bag, but North Face backpack. And so it's, it's a good size, it's a good feel. I don't have any gear in it whatsoever, so I couldn't tell you how it feels if when it feels heavy. These are just my first impressions right now. Um, the only thing I've noticed that I really am just a little sad about, there's no straps on the side so, or on the bottom. So I can't just like attach a tripod to it. I'd have to carry a tripod or whatever. Um, so this is really for like an on the go, definitely an on the go type of deal. Not when you're trying to set up a tripod and move and things like that. Um, but that's like in the side and the size of the pockets on the side. But in terms of like inside organization, things like that, um, it is beautiful. It works out just fine. Um, and you can customize it to literally whatever you needed and how much gear you actually have and actually own and leaves room to grow, <laughs> leaves room to grow. Um, but that is it for me, everybody. Um, you know, make sure to follow me on Instagram so you can see how I use this bag in the future. Got some good stuff coming up here in the future. Um, so make sure to follow me on Instagram and on all the social medias and so guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button hit that bell notification button down below so you never miss anything and hit that like button as well um but until next time <laughs> i crack myself up but uh, that is
keeps up with my bangs. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but... Okay, but until next time, everybody, keep turning the pages.